Hi, I'm David Cooper from Clavinova Clinic. Today I'm going to show you a tip for using the rhythm section and the chord features on the Clavinovas. It's also the same as all the Yamaha keyboards too. And the beauty of the, the ranges are that they have the split point that you can bring in, but also you can decide on how you want to play your chords on the keyboard. So if we go on to this main screen on this particular model, we've got a split and fingering. And we can press that button and the screen comes up with two things that we can adjust. We've got the split point for when you're having a, a lower chord area and an upper melody area, but also um, we've also got the choice of how our chords are being played. So it sets a single fingered chord at the moment. That basically means I can play a, a whole chord from one note. The C note produces a C chord, F chord, F note, or an E flat chord, E flat note. But I can also have um, different types of chords. And if I just come out of this screen a moment to show you, we can go and each chord will show on the chord area what we're playing. So a C chord, it does show me here I'm playing a C. If I play a black note below my chord note, so C with a black note below, it makes it C minor. We go C and little m for minor. And I can get to any minor chord by the main note of the chord, so A flat with any black note below it. A flat minor. If I wanted to play B minor, I'd play the B note with a black note below it. There we go. Now we can also get um, minor seventh chords. So we can go to a seventh, which is the white note below. So C7, C, and the white note below makes C seventh. Or A with the white note below, A7. And also we can make minor seventh. So let's go C black and white below together, and we've got a full chord of C minor seventh now. So when you're playing, you might want to use the music which has got a chord symbol above the, the melody line, and that would mean that you can either play all these chords properly, but you can simplify it by going to one note or uh, single fingered chord, and that means that any chord I want to play, I can just jump to it. A flat, C, A flat seventh, and it shows you that you've got the right chord on the screen, so it's very clear what you've actually chosen. So this is known as single fingered chord and, and it's quite a good way to just be able to go through a piece of music very quickly and not have to think of all the intricate chord changes. Okay that's single fingered chord. Have a look at our other videos to find out the other chord methods. I hope you found that useful.